Now, I'd like to make um, points of interest regarding users of text edit on the Mac. If you create a, a new text edit document on the Mac, and for example, to start writing or cutting and pasting your code in here, everything seems fine, looks like a text file. You would imagine a plain text file. But if I open up the text file, which was saved from Word and Windows, you see a slightly subtle difference. All this header material here, which is available when I open the text edit window is different from the edit window I open and it's still text edit. You see I've clicked on here and it's still text edit. It's different from the one which is saved from Word, for example, in this file. Is that a problem? Yes, it is, because if I go to the one which I opened with just open up a text edit window normally, if I want to save this file, you can see the default is rich text document. And what we actually need is plain text document, TXT. And there isn't such an option. Well, how do we get around this? The way you get around that is to go to the text edit preferences and you need to select plain text here. And for the open and save, you need to set the encoding to be UTF-8, could be UTF-16, which is more used for uh, character sets which are beyond the European character sets, such as Chinese character sets. But for most Western languages, uh, UTF-8 will be fine. And then you can save that, it automatically saves. If I then quit that window, don't save it and open up a new text document. I'll get rid of this, open up a brand new text document. So from now on, it's reserved those settings and you can see it doesn't have the extra header information for bolding the text, etc. And when I do a save, you can see it's already set to Unicode 8 and it's set there for a plain text document. So again, if you're using not say that, if you're using text edit to write your text in, not too likely, I don't think, but you have to make sure the document is saved as plain text UTF eight.